Now I want to move the ball to the left. So now what I want to do is I want to create draw spin. What you're going to do is you're going to set your body out to the right, but again, you're going to keep the club face at the target, at the target line you're starting the ball on. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the club now, and I'm going to go like this, and I'm just going to toe it in like this, and then I'm going to grip it normal or neutral, just like that. So I have my normal grip, but the club is towed in a little bit. Club face gets like this. Now I get set up like that. Now I'm going to swing along that line. And now all of a sudden, that well, I got a little bit. Hold on. Let's try that again. Well, so by taking the club face and turning the club face in, I can create different spins. Right? So if I open the club face, I can create a right spin. And when I shut the club face, I can create a left spin. Back, but the general rule is where you're going to swing the club is roughly where the ball is going to start and swing to the to the where you want the ball to start so if I'm setting up here and I want to start the ball at that third red target there I'm going to leave the club face set up to that the target where the ball where we want the ball to finish and then I'm going to swing this club so that it goes out to the right there and then it draws back and you can see this is really turning hard there so I shut that club face down and made sure that that thing went to the left Now, here's the thing that's important for you to, to get into your mind. Through practice, through practice, what you're going to do is you're going to understand just how much, when you start turning the face in or turning the face open, just how much the ball's going to spin and the ball's going to move.